Bravo was so happy. Cuteness is justice, that's why he's loved by Jimmy. My bow and Jimmy, Jimmy's so silly. Cuteness is justice, that's why my bow loves Jimmy. Hello, Governor. It's a hell of a day. <laughs> Hello, this is Bobo. This is Jimmy. And you're probably wondering why we're wearing these stupid little rain hats, but we saw in the preview for this show last week that Elle of a Day, in the unconventional challenge, was sitting around being interviewed wearing one of these little umbrella hats. And we just happen to have some <laughs> from the Dallas Zoo. <laughs> we're going to take it off now, and we're going to watch UK Symphony. Season 3, Episode Number 3. Let's see if it's an hell of a day. Yay, let's do it. We find out about Victoria. Your knee injury requires additional evaluation. Depending on what the doctors say, we'll decide whether or not it's safe for you to continue in this competition. Cliff mm. hungers, cliff hungers. No oh, cliffhanger. <laughs> Oh my god, gag. And then jumps, and I thought, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no one's electric sweaty cooch on the face. Love, love, love electric with all my heart. But when it comes down to it, that's what you have to do. That's the name of the game. Yeah. On one hand, no. I'm upset, but on the other hand, I am so happy to still be in the competition. Banana leaf. You know, my knee is hurting, but my soul is saying, just push through it, just push through it. This is like uh. the biggest opportunity of your life, and you can't let your knee fuck this up for you. So but do you know, she'd be on next yeah. season, it might even be better up. for her. Oh, yeah, right. Says. Hopefully, I'll get the all clear. Having said that, it's not over yet. It's not over till the fat lady sings, as Crystal says. <laughs> 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 I really thought I was lip syncing tonight. I'm surprised that you weren't lip syncing. I'm just going to be honest. <laughs> Actually, yeah. People are saying Scarlett also should be in the bottom. <laughs> I like her Yeah, I love yeah, Scarlett. That's, that's, yeah. oh, that's, 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 that's what saved her. Yeah. That's what probably kept her from being yeah. in the bottom. I, think the I saw a nipple. Eh. <laughs> I saw uh, there's a TV series, a British TV series mm -hmm. she's in, and I can't remember the name of it. But high school girls in Breton, somewhere in Breton. Uh -huh. Bring it around. Oh my gosh! Crystal's drag race. <laughs> there's got to be something that Crystal can't do. Let's get a tap dance to. Then we'll see who's boss. What about if there's another <laughs> dance challenge? I mean, I'll be bricking it, but yeah. I guess bricking it seems to be getting me badges. <laughs> so <laughs> I'll just keep bricking it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and I'm really uh, liking Teresa. Yeah, Teresa. Oh, maybe we're going for a walk. A walk. A walk about. Hello, hello, hello. I think that's from Down Under. I have some unfortunate news to report. Based on medical advice, the amazing and talented Victoria Scone will not be returning to the competition. Oh, oh, I, we didn't notice that. Like, She's not here. Well, didn't they notice it? So as much as I could be happy that one of my biggest competitors is gone, I'm not feeling that right now. Didn't they uh, to realize in the room that yeah. she wasn't there? Yeah. The show must go on. Okay, so next season. Yeah. It it's sometimes better. Today's mini challenge. You sometimes things happen for a reason for that you don't understand. Out. The new dating app for the ambiguously straight bloke. Who just can't seem to find the right girl. <laughs> Have I ever dated a girl? Not in a while. But never say never, ladies. <laughs> but first, I don't see that one. <laughs> you have to get into quick butch track. Now, butch. <laughs> butch track. Butch track. Some of these yeah. thems and days it's I cannot fun. see so as butch it's track. Pull my butch finger. <laughs> Kitty, Kitty's got claws. <laughs> All I see is girls and beards. I'm not quite sure I've hit the breeze here. Wow! Look at you. Look at Scarlett. And Kitty's got claws. Is wearing. Duke Daisy Duke shorts, which no straight dude this guy. Vanity Milan. Walk one. My name is Victoria Scone. I'm 
name's Barry Butterman. I can't find a girl because they can't handle all of this, you know, me. Say what they call <laughs> jerk chicken. The jerk, the, the jerk chicken. <laughs> Have you ever been married? I I'm married, though. You are married. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, let me say he's for real. He's <laughs> <laughs> for real. <laughs> <laughs> that pepperoni, was... pepperoni, me hobby star doing doggy style. Like this, you can see what. That was very sexy. <laughs> Girls, swipe left. Boys, swipe right. I'll see you in the sauna. <laughs> Scarlet Harlot. Alright, lads, my name's Kerry. I'm 26 and I am the king of the carpet burn because I always leave the girls pussy on fucking fire, mate. <laughs> I don't like a girl who farts in bed, and I'll tell you that because I'm looking for your loving oven, not your fucking dutch oven, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I like a girl who's got originality, personality, she's sweet, she's kind, and she's got big old tits, she's gonna eat your fucking dinner off. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Swipe right all the way, that's a super like from me. <laughs> I'm John Dick, I'm 19, I'm Dan Ken, and I love me some chick. The face is so small. <laughs> yeah. It's like a girl, I mean. Almost like Avatar. Yeah. Block, delete, turn the phone off. <laughs> My name is Albert Prince, aka there is no safe word. <laughs> My character was this sort of straight man who loves his group activities. <laughs> Relatable content. <laughs> <laughs> there, there are no safe words. I tell you what though, I am a bit anal about cleanliness though. I don't like people who leave a mess. So, I mean, if, you, if you're gonna not clear up after yourself, at least put down a tarp or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Charity case. Well, how the ladies, my name is Billy Blue Ball. <laughs> you might also know me as Pigmaster69 from my viral video, Two Pigs, One Man. Two <laughs> Pigs, One Man. On by big pink ears, upturned noses, and a love for getting dirty. <laughs> oh, God. That sounds lovely. Kitty <laughs> Scott Claus. <laughs> Children in nature. Second category is. Do you walk children in nature? What the fuck? Or the potty. Oh, 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 she says, I don't see you walking children in Tammy nature. Brown. Tammy Brown. That's what she <laughs> referred to. Oh. Potter. Picture yourself. Potty. Prostitute. You want today's miniature. Porter. So I'm giving Potter. you a head start Prostitute. of 15 seconds. Ah! I didn't do it. <laughs> Campers, start your engines. And may the best drag queen win! <laughs> <laughs> Kitty is filling us off with bloody sweets. 
Dr. Cobb. I have never been camping in my life, and we've got to make a garment out of camping materials. This is my worst nightmare. You're gonna fight over the grass. Oh, marshmallows. <laughs> Oh, that would be great yeah. material if, if you can solve it. Right. This lovely rubber material. Oh, that would be good. I've got everything right in the room. Where's the marble wearing the top hat in the mix? It's giving me a good feeling. I designed most of my stuff, although I don't make it. Yeah, so I think I could win the challenge. Ooh, ooh. But you don't make ooh, it. Ooh. <laughs> I feel confident with this sewing challenge. However, so far I don't think You're such I a chance. Yeah. My looks, so I definitely need something that will be able to show myself off. Have you have you sewn outfits before? I've never used like non-stretch fabric, <laughs> but I think which is all of these. And I've got like a waterproof jacket, right? Times two. Look at these. Fish things. <laughs> I don't know what this material is like to sew with. Probably really nice. with that. I don't know. It would pop. <laughs> Maybe. I mean, as soon as you put a stitch go, there. I have no idea of what I'm going to do. I am up to the street. Hello. I truly have no paddle. And be creative. Aw, oh, Scarlett. Scarlett's going at it like she knows what she's doing. Uh -huh. Oh is my it, goodness. This is like. Uh, a charity is out of Haiti. I don't know. <laughs> oh, hey, let me go. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. Raise your hand if you design things for yourself. Oh, okay. So those two. Yes. Okay. I see that Kitty Scott Claus has raised a finger. <laughs> what does that mean? I do you know how to sew. My grandma gave me a crash course. Now, uh, Teresa, do you know how to sew? Uh, come into the show. I, I have nothing else to do but be in, in the house. So I started doing a dress a day to get a little bit quicker. Oh, wow. I know Veronica can sew. Oh. When we shut down production last year, I went home and I was feeling creatively starved. We were all locked in our homes. So I decided I wanted to make a dress. I had no money, but I found lots of tool for very, very cheap. And that was last week's runway. Uh, so you've got, it looks like a red set blanket this yours? This is not mine, no, no. So I've got the tents <laughs> over here, which are non-stretch. So I'm hoping to make a lovely dragonfly outfit. Oh, that's a silhouette that is specifically you. I like to be ambitious with my designs. I like to go big. Go big or go home. Uh, that was the bridge of the nose. Right. I'm highlighting the tent. I say go as tiny and skinny <laughs> as you can. Tiny and skinny as little old me. <laughs> I really like to come. I, I, I like Jerry's cute little goofy outfit. <laughs> Who sews? I sew. You sew? Yeah, this challenge is right up my street, if I'm honest. I'm used to making stuff from rubbish and materials that aren't usually worked with. And what about you? Something I can mold to my body. Wow. Tin Have you ever used anything like this before? To cook? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like a challenge. Because Silver, sort of, we remember using Silver last week. Oh dear. Oh, oh yeah. you bring that out. Just smile. Yeah. Act like you've got gas. <laughs> You're just letting it creep out through your head. Just smile. <laughs> Great advice. It looks like you meeting your god. Like an Yes, very that. I really? feel like, yeah, the goddess is in front of me right now. <laughs> I'm very starstruck. Really? Yeah. So when That's who she emulates. Yeah. introduced to the magic of Raven? Because are you 19 years old? I'm 19. It was season two. She was eight. <laughs> <laughs> She was eight. Seconds. Are those pants right there? No, these are panels for a dress. Uh -huh. So... Oh. And actually, I managed to get something stretchy. Oh, good for you. She's sewing oh, already. Wow. Well, thank you, ladies. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Thank you, guys. It is like meeting a star. Yeah. Ladies, Especially for her makeup skills. On the main stage, you'll they didn't go for no, they didn't go. Good luck. <laughs> And River Medley and who else? I love a day. With these patterns, right. I'm scared that if I make it too small, then when I sew it, it won't it'll be too small and I won't be too tight. So what you've already done, which is good, mm -hmm. is you've already left extra around it. Okay. So this will be half an inch already on, too much. On, on. No. Nice that yeah. oh. But, 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 but did you see, see how precise mm -hmm. the right. patterns were with her pins? Mm -hmm. um, right. 
from yeah, um, like Scarlet it was amazing. Because yeah. yeah. obviously big ones are going to come out with the material, so it's like they're kind of flat ones. Do you think they should go like all the way around, or just like one with the spikes? Yeah. Well, 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 they like, like, Who's like, asking yeah. whom? Yeah. yeah. All right, thank you. Oh, Chris Crystal was actually asking uh, River Medley. Yeah. Medway? Crystal. Medway. I definitely could have walked her through how to make her entire outfit, but I don't have the time to do that. I don't yeah. myself. No. So if she wants to get help from other people, Absolutely. that's fine, but it's not going to be me. you got to focus on yeah. you. It's competition. Okay, that's an idea. <laughs> that's an idea. <laughs> <laughs> But then I ended up contracting HIV, oh. and it was kind of like really hard for me to process that at like 18, and I was still a child, do oh, you know what I mean? Yeah. From that, one night I contracted HIV, I contracted lots of other STIs, and that's really difficult, because six years on, I'm still living with the after effects of this one night where this guy took advantage of me. Oh. Yeah. How's it been with like dating and stuff? Like on social dating apps, people message saying like, "Oh, you're dis just you're diseased, you're disgusting, stay away from me," you know, just oh, like no. horrible, nasty comments that are really degrading and mean. And the trauma of getting diagnosed positive really comes from like the stigma of HIV, yeah. and it's really sad that that's still such a thing. When I was 18 and I was diagnosed, I didn't even really know what HIV was. And the stigma that I had felt is you have got a disease and it is dirty and you should be ashamed. After having those negative experiences, I, I haven't put myself out there at all. I would love a relationship. I would love to feel like close with somebody, but I just don't feel capable of like putting myself in that place where I'm so vulnerable that like someone can tear me down over something. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't apologize. Like, it's not even to do with HIV. No, it's more, it's more to do with, like, feeling lonely. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I mean, bitch, you're not lonely. You've got fucking <laughs> sisters for life now. I take three tablets a day, and I live a normal life expectancy, and I am undetectable. That means that the virus cannot be passed on from me. This is major, major steps towards controlling the virus. Drag was a massive, massive help for me, like, coping with these emotions that I didn't know how to deal with. Like, becoming charity was definitely a sort of therapy to me, and it was a way for me to express myself. Yeah. And also celebrating the beauty of darkness, you yeah. know? From it blossomed me and blossomed charity. I wouldn't change my experiences for the world, because mm. I'm really proud of who I am today. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I am comfortable with what I do and who I am, and that is why I'm so passionate about my drag, and why I put my all into it, and why I spend every moment of every day creating something to distract myself from the dark places that I've been to and the dark places that I can still go to and there are lots of good things about me and Charity Caves is one of them to me I think confidence and it's this whole persona and it's like you're a fucking rock star oh, thank you Yay. the stigma hasn't gone anywhere and unless you have a personal connection with somebody who has that experience, you're not educated around it. Yeah. It's important that it's taught in schools. And that's why it's important that we talk about it. Oh god, I just wanna hug you. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I'm okay, you know, like I feel I'm in a really good place about my hair side. I really feel for her. It's just heartbreaking to think that she'd have to go through that. I'm amazing. <laughs> She's already wearing a yeah, orange yeah. cap. The cap is that color. Right, time to put the back and find a way to cover it with this then. Okay. So maybe get get the panels cut out. Yeah. And glue it on. Yeah. Okay. Veronica is spending quite a lot of time helping other queens and I look at her dress and it's quite a project. Mm. I don't know if she has everything under control. I mean, she's a professional, so I am hoping she's aware of the very limited time that we have to pull this together. Uh. <laughs> I love charity for out of drag. Yeah. Adorable. <laughs> 
I felt okay to start off with because I know I, I like can the hat. The idea I like of the plaid that Element A is using. All I see is the strap right now. That's a cool looking plaid. How's yours going? Shit it balls. Really good. Mm -hmm. so That's what I always say. Like Shit balls. Like, I made like one dress in my whole life. I get the tables up <laughs> I'm making a dress out of a picnic fold out rubber mat and oh. two raincoats. This is so far from what I do normally. And I'm starting to feel confident with my outfit. And I never saw that one coming because she's a sewer. I'm a, a novice. And we seem to have gone. Right, now stop talking to me because I will ignore you. Good luck. And don't fuck yourself. Too late. Mm. Oh. 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 This actually looks like a proper real material. Oh. Oh. I chose a sleeping bag to make my outfit from. It's this iridescent rose gold material. It's quite fabulous. Don't fit vanity, so it's a bit fancy. <laughs> The problem is with Vanity's outfit, like, it's creative, but oh. when you go shoot in a horse here, it's kind of like, and they'll go in this competition. Crystal, she looks like a walking bacteria. <laughs> I think it's like it's still it's gonna end up yeah, looking fabulous. Yeah, because she has a little crystal's yeah. gonna end up looking fabulous. Uh, I'm like running really, really behind. I've had to cut this way, way, that way. Most of it barely legal. I'm not feeling like a happy camper this morning. My outfit's in Oh my god. I'm feeling really confident about my concept. But construction is running behind schedule. Yeah. For the top half. I was going to continue this sort of pattern, and the idea was to maybe use the remaining ruffles as like a sleeve. Okay. It looks like it's finished. Thank well, you. and you helped me as well, like give me advice. So thank you. Well, I think moving forwards, I'm going to have to stop giving you advice because if you get a third win in a row from everyone helping you out, <laughs> I will hit the roof. <laughs> And you have the makeup too. Oh. Is that charity? Yeah, of course. Wearing something else on her face. Covering up that cute face. Hello. Wow. I like this dress. I like a hair. Yeah, I like this. Michelle Massage. Oh. Now, Michelle, have you ever gone camping? Well, of course. And it was intense. <laughs> Intense, get it? They were intense, or it was intense. <laughs> and National Treasure, oh, Graham no. Norton. Graham, do you have any camping tips? Uh, stay in a hotel. I agree 100%. <laughs> if I'm lying on the ground, I'll be in the car. Glamping. <laughs> Glamping is the and only way to go. Extra special guest judge, oh. Nicola Coughlin. Nicola, do you like it outdoors? Oh, Rue, you know me. I like it anywhere. Well, then you've come to the right place. <laughs> we're so happy you're here. Me too. This week we challenged our queens to serve two camp-inspired looks. Racers, uh, start our uh, engines, and name the best uh, 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 Can you feel the love? The category is Happy Campers happy. in the Great Outdoors. First up, Crystal oh. Sanchi. <laughs> Go Scout. Oh. I'm giving you sexy Scout Go Rowan. Look at how tiny. Oh my god. She's got some thin mitts. <laughs> <laughs> she is the one that's going to put you in your place and give you your back. Oh, beautiful. Now, Sash, Shay, <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Sash, Shay. Okay, next, Kitty Scott Claus. And I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> that's <laughs> cute. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> the way she's selling it. <laughs> Love it. So <laughs> fucking cute. <laughs> River Medway. Net amused. I've got a mosquito. Oh, okay, so it's I'm what's the what's it's a, a map. 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 I've had to make a dress out of. Can I see that show? Lost. <laughs> Lost. <laughs> But I don't know if it's camping, yeah. but it's comfy camp. I like the top part. Yeah. If the way it's done, I'm not sure that I like the skirt part. <laughs> Scary. That's gonna be some kid's worst birthday party ever. Oh my god. Clueless girls night out. I wanted to do like a rabbit that's murdered a girl guide. It puts the lotion in the bag. Exactly. <laughs> I airbrushed the bodysuits. 
I wore as well, so it's like a muscly, scary, fierce rabbit. Oh my movie. god. Ever wonder what happens with a rabbit in Fatal Attraction? <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like that. Yeah, I like that. I don't know why. I'm so... This is camping? Did you know English? And now she's a high fashion bitch. And it's a parachute. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sleeping. I don't know what's this thing. This is camping? It's cool looking. Yeah. Shave above your knees. Shave above your knees. That's funny. Oh. The emo sheriff of Nottingham. I'm going for like a Katniss Everdeen, Beyond Thunderdome, Hunger Games vibe in this runway. I don't know about Campy. How did you launch? Those are the largest sacks I've ever seen. I doubt that. I'm the baddest bitch walking down this runway. I look amazing in this jacket. I am smiling uh, just as well. I like the I am having a jacket, but it's Did not connected to the side. jacket. Yeah, the outfit in the jacket. I'm not. She came into the competition with a lot of baggage. <laughs> like I like the the, the jacket. People like crap with a net. Yeah. This is a kid. She is trying to catch butterflies all the time, looking out for Tarzan. This is a different look for me. I okay. I push myself huh. with this one to go for like a full character. And I, feel I can see that in like, like a TV British show. show. Yeah. That's really what I'm available for. Veronica Green. Oh. It's a sleeping hack. Yeah. <laughs> she woke up like this. <laughs> the story behind the look is that I am at a festival and I've just woken up after a big night out. I don't know where <laughs> Veronica is going. <laughs> She's at a festival like Burning Man. Uh, one of those uh, festivals and she woke up looking like that. No. Yeah. After a night of debauchery, campfire okay. Oh. I mean, sometimes I wonder, what's the point? Well, she does have a point. <laughs> yeah, sure. But can you sit in it? She wow. made that. I believe I've made this outfit. I'm wearing picnic blankets, I'm wearing tent poles, I'm wearing metal sticks, I'm being stabbed so in the So skinny. <laughs> so tiny. Just deal with it. Wow. Wow. That's cool. Yes. Another one. Yet another one. He's got claws. This is Ooh, a sleeping bag. That's good. I'm saving these futuristic Barbarella meets Judy Jetson. What? I can't believe I've made this from scratch. It's, 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 it's quite cool. impressive. Serious. Poise. Oh, tips for days. <laughs> I'm giving the judges. Eat it up. Where's the bowl? For her pleasure. Where does this use bowl? Up next, River Midway. The bow. Fly the friendly skies of Midway. Oh, I like this one. I think it's cute. I'm giving you full trolley. That's cute. Yeah. I'm living for it. Do you get a repeat? The pattern is really looking for the start. And... Oh, I've made this outfit I like out this of one. a patterned picnic blanket. I've made the hats out of paper plates and a camping mat. Yes. The exit up. is the exit. Ex oh, and then I'm going to say. Oh, near here. Oh. I know. I know where it is. It's the Yeah. Up yeah. <laughs> <laughs> next, charity case. Welcome to the circus. Hello. Oh, wow. I'm wearing a tablecloth with my ass cheeks out. The paper bar my outfit is. That's fun. <laughs> I'm giving you Willy Wonka's side hustle. Hey, Mr. Wonka. I kind of like it. Yeah. <laughs> Don't you hate it when you forget the back Is it called dress? whimsical? That's whimsical. Yeah. Well, our next one. <laughs> Theresa May. There you go. <laughs> I am giving you the most femme fatale feel that I have. I feel powerful. Uh, wow. Feel she beautiful. made this? Yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> That's, that's cool. My outfit is made from a blanket. I spray paint some hearts in it. I have a little bit of a Spanish ruffle, a very sensible turtleneck. Who knew a picnic blanket could be this evil, <laughs> fabulous? I think it's the red eye to get here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Scarlet Harlot. Oh. I heard she's blanketing wow. the area. I am serving a tartan princess. I, I, I love that. that. I'll carry a gorgeous garment, gorgeous silhouette. Wow. Out, tips. Right and she in. sewed that. Yeah. She has just not been the same since she went blonde. Oh, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, Vanity Milan. Oh, my stomach's a nut. I think oh. I, that turned out. Yeah, she did a great job. Tribal African princess realness. That really turned out. Yeah. Ropes are robust around my Giving some pictures. Yeah. 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 I mean, from afar. Yeah. Now, maybe up close, the quality might not be good. I don't know. But from afar, it looks like she probably would have served. 
And also TVs, bro. <laughs> the TV has gone blurry right now. Hello, <laughs> Made. Oh. Glad for it. With this look, I am serving. I like. I like jacket. She's up all night. She's dancing all day. She made that. Wow. And put the cuffs, mm. the same matching cuffs, yeah. on the coat. Mostly on her shoulders. Yeah. Yeah. I feel sexy. I feel young. And I nice. feel cool, which I don't say very much. I'm a cool mom. <laughs> they call me Poncho. <laughs> they call me Poncho. I was a showgirl. Veronica Green. Oh, okay. Guys, is this mascara waterproof? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Do you? Yeah. Is it if it would have emphasized her waist more? Uh, do you think it's too much? But I like this one. I think it's okay. Am I happy with my final design? No. Am I going to sell out the runway? No? Yes, of course. Yeah, I, am. I mean. <laughs> no, I, I, love, I love it personally, so yeah. I don't know. Welcome, ladies. I think Thanks. it doesn't work. I don't know anymore. Happy runway presentations. I've made some decisions. Kitty Scott Claus. Mm -hmm. River Medway. Charity case. You are all safe. Wow. Charity case. Use the stage. I'm, I'm the most happy for Charity Case. Mm. I know Kitty's Got Claws is going to keep going. Yeah. But I just didn't want you Charity. The tops and bottoms. Eh? The tops and bottoms. Now it's time for the judges' critique. Bottom. First up, Crystal Versace. I love when you came out in your Girl Scout outfit. Yeah, I love was the green inside Michelle. You are false. <laughs> Already I'm, I want a bit more. You were what I expected today. I thought you just surprised me. Oh, shut okay. up, Graham. You did something that is <laughs> who you are, so keep doing what you're doing, but keep pushing yourself. I know you're a baby, that's, but you're that's a good, That's way. still good. Yeah. If you're doing this at 19, I'd hate you. <laughs> you're brilliant. Thank you. Up next, Theresa May. I didn't quite understand the backpack. It took me out of it. <laughs> I love the look on your face. I don't know, that makes Super me laugh. I don't know what the vision was. So I was meant to be like a climber, but instead of fur, I wanted to use like feathers. Like a rock climber. Yes. Now a bit. Another one way. It's a really, really fun idea. She's in the bottom. Here. Just the finishing touches are not up to par with some of the other looks that are really? on the stage tonight. She's so I made this from a black hey. kid. And I wanted to create a super villain. What's my story, you may ask? <laughs> I found who I thought was my first love, and he invited me to his tent. He kissed in my eye and blinded me in the middle of the night. <laughs> he left running, and I went to find him. Probably I was blind. So I found this owl, so we became friends. And since then, he's been guiding me through the night. <laughs> Apparently. Well, thank you. <laughs> Not that well. Up next, oh, no. Charlotte Harlot. So your first look was a bit John Jet meets Katniss Everdeen. For me, it was a, a little bit cosplay-y. This is so stunning. Wait, this layer is not easy especially to work with a fleece material you just really look at elegant in a blanket can you flick your hair back like Cher? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Up next, good so Jerry good I see you use that highlighter that looks so gorgeous thank you so your first look when you came out here again, this is a confusing like, mm, camping this to me is much better i would never thought i would say to anyone my like neon orange is yours but that is I would have loved to see that matched with an orange lip. Mm. What did you use? To yeah, her lip one? goes so away. Um, different colored brooks adhered to uh, a corset and a bra, and then the underskirt is actually a blow up bit. Had you him that skirt, it would have been even. Obviously, it's not constructed as well as I wanted it to be constructed, but it definitely shows you who I am. I like tribal African, definitely my background, and I definitely wanted to show you that on the runway today. Okay, I like thank you. Room. Thank you very much. Up next, hello. Hello. Day. hello. Your first look just like hit my sweet spot, whatever it was, it was just great. Mm -hmm. I love camp done really well. I think this on the runway tonight is really fun. What I love most about it is the plaid cuffs that you put onto the rain ponchos, but I can't wait to really kind of figure out, oh, that's who Ella is, because I'm not sure who it is yet, but mm -hmm. I like what I see. Okay, mm -hmm. I think it's like a school girl going to school on a rainy day. I didn't really completely honest to understand the story it must have been like out of some kind of festival but i was hoping that like if it were the festival maybe there'd be tickets or cigarette butts because i think you were halfway there you just weren't all the way there this huh. one tonight there's so much going on that i don't know what to look at first you're tiny 
so I lose a lot of you in this, it all becomes just a giant. They're going to come out with rainbow kites sticking out of them, and it's all going to be rainbow colors. You think, what a joyous, happy thing that will be. And yet it's quite dark and somber. It, it was quite a dark and somber uh, moment. I had a bit of a rough year. And going through a depression in the summer stripped everything away from me. And what I wanted to show you tonight was that through sadness, there, there, is, there is happiness yeah. and, and there is light at the end of the tunnel. Well, as the wings indicate, you have emerged from the ruins. And here you are to yeah. inspire so many other people. We're very proud of you. Thank you. So, so I think it's said there was a meaning. There was meaning behind it. But it's <laughs> so in the story, uh, like you're not going to just know it. And it means something to her, yeah. not to anybody else. Uh, you yeah. could visually tell what the story is. I was convinced that you'd be lip syncing. <gasps> That's just how I see it. What? That's fair enough. But this is great. I really like this. Yeah, nice oh, yeah. Again, it's a concept show. Oh. I cannot believe that Charity is safe. She was my top tooth of the week. Granted, it's only half costume. I feel like this is really going to get to her. Oh. So the bottom two are Teresa uh, and Veronica. I don't think Ella Day got that many as bad a review. Do you think that's fair with all the help you got? What does that matter? Oh wow, that was direct. <laughs> I asked for some help, but it was only questions, and Veronica did help me, like, I really am thankful for you to be there, and because I do look up to you, but I did work my ass off, and so, if I win, I deserve it. I don't mind if she wins this after she's had the help. I guess it's clever to a certain extent. Is it clever or is it lazy? Oh. Oh. Bertie, how oh, about you? I don't see how they challenge to design something with more couture mm -hmm. and that's what I was thinking yeah instead of something that you can get off the rack yeah and there are outfits here that look like you can get it off the rack I agree Scarlet looks like you can get it off the rack huh. I thought Vanity was my mate and then she just throws me under the bus in front of the other girls I'm a bit like oh okay you gonna just have to record it and I made a gown so yeah well, I've got terrible time management issues that that's something that is always on my mind and i felt like i helped quite a few people as well and now i'm thinking that that maybe that stopped me from at least being safe you know i didn't put enough energy into what me. else would she have done differently <sighs> had she had more time uh, if i am Teresa may after she explains herself everything makes less sense <laughs> <laughs> Her personality shines through, and that's what makes you connect to these queens. I love her. That mad story. I want to see Theresa in another episode. Very, very, very to be longer. The thing is, Theresa needs to pay attention to the details. The wrinkling, the corset, the dirty tights. I love that. That tells me <laughs> the title of the dirty club. Tights. The corset, the wrinkling, the dirty tights. <laughs> Vanity Milan. The first book, I don't care how much y'all want to sell me editorial and how much y'all want to sell me fashion. This was not an outdoor look. The metallic cat suit. I mean, it would stop you dying of hypothermia. That's true. Yeah. That is true. Maybe, I maybe diving. Just, I don't, I didn't understand that. You could see that she's doubting herself. And yeah. I wanted to shake her though. Uh, I've made my decision. Bring uh, back my girls. Where they at? <laughs> Hell of a day. You're safe. Oh. Thank you very much. Oh, I knew that. Hello, Dave. The Crystal Versace. <laughs> gotta be safe. You are safe. Uh, so, Scar Scarlet? <gasps> Scarlet? Scarlet. Scarlet just won. Scarlet Harlot. Congratulations. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Thank you so much. Yay! Yay! I forgot about the bat! Oh. Teresa May, your happy camper. I want to see another week for Teresa. And your stories behind your list are entertaining. Thank you. You're safe. You are safe. Ah! Yes! Enjoy the other girls. 
Thank you, bitches. Wow. Oh, bad. Oh. Vanity Milan, uh. Veronica Green. I'm sorry, my dears, but you are up for elimination. I've consulted if they with the judges. Both kill it, the then neither of them has to, to go because uh, Victoria Scone yes. went home. This is your yeah, chance. that's right. She that's could me. save two. That's right. So if they're and close, two. they could both be saved. <gasps> <laughs> I've never seen Rue do that before. That was funny. I'm in the bottom two, and I was the only queen on season two who never had to lip sync. Now I'm going to show That's you right. what it's all about. That's right. Let's go, Vanity And don't fuck it up. They're close. <laughs> She's tearing herself apart. <laughs> Is giving energy. I, I think Vanity has this one. I don't know. <laughs> they both are giving it. But I like Vanity's better. Yeah. Yeah. Vanity. That is Yay. really like was she she was performing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's gonna let them both stay. Ladies. I've made my decision. You're both gonna stay. Vanity Milan. Shantae, you stay. Oh. Thank you so much. Veronica Green. Always remember and never forget. She is saying goodbye. The amazing queen that you are. Now. Yeah. Hey. Really? Thank you. Changing my life and thank you for everything you've given me. Wow. This is uh, tough. I will never forget what you have done for me. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. Uh, oh. uh, 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 uh
Madden. Madden, Madden Party. Madden Party. <laughs> Just her. Okay. So, um, that was a fun show. Uh, mm-hmm. It was extremely emotional. Very please. Sorry. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know why that, that was so... It hit me strong. Mm-hmm. I think she's such an innocent soul and... And yeah. have to you know, fight over some you know, one bad night, yeah. one bad fucking mm-hmm. night. Yeah. Uh, but things happen to us, in, yeah. and it's part of our journey so that we can learn more about ourselves. Yeah, and, and maybe like that's she, her, you know, pass it, for her part. Yeah, you know, and she might be able to help others. lots and lots and yeah. lots of other kids that mm-hmm. have done the same kind of thing or just are in the same situation or very similar situations. Yeah. So. Um, and Victoria has gone. I'm so sorry, but the uh, help is yeah. coming back strong. Yeah, that yeah. might be the best thing that ever happened for her, mm-hmm. to be honest, because by then everybody's going to know her name. Mm-hmm. She will have toured around and be able to perform for a whole year, unless COVID's really bad again, yeah. which it kind of is. But if it lightens up by the time she can come back uh, next year, um, she'll have more confidence. Yeah. So. Let's say, oh yeah, more followers, all that fun stuff. So. Yeah. Alrighty, righty. What did you think about this episode? Please tell us what you thought. Yes. As usual. Hey. Alright. Love you. Done. Alrighty. Bye. Bye. Bye.